Talk bye. Oh, fuck. Shit. We're doing welfare checks. It's very cold and the windows have to be down because someone breathes too much. On last week's video, I had to cut a chunk out because I kept quoting lyrics from a song and it got demonetized and claimed for copyright. So I'm flattered I'm such a great singer, but really? <laughs> so all further ensembles will be coming from Slug. We're currently in the used paddock that we're lambing and they've kind of just stopped. We were getting, you know, one, two a day for like two solid weeks and they've, they've just stopped lambing. Knock, knock. Please answer the door or we are coming in. First of all, it's not a door. Yeah. Shit, I thought I was about to lose my phone. Next paddock. Right, you be on the lookout for anyone down. I'll be looking out for everyone else. Oh, Dad's calling. Beautiful looking sky this morning. Go the fat lambs. Week from today, they're going. More sheep who should have lambed but have not. You like to explain yourselves, ladies. Were the rams not doing it for you? Were the rams not doing it? Bees. Whoop, we stalled. I'm literally going gate to gate. Hello ladies, I would like to talk to you about our Lord and Saviour, Green Doritos. I don't fucking know, that's one of the first things that came to my head. This is the other half of that mob there, so I'm expecting same similar pregnancy stage. Boys clearly did not get busy early. There's just no titties. The reason I'm looking for titties is generally after they start to, you know, bag up, get some tits, they are close to lambing. Next on the list, we have the Merinos, where the crossbreds went through the fence. We haven't fixed that yet. Na, 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 na. Oh, they're up there too. They're watching. They're watching me from everywhere. Are we all alive? I've been trying to contact you about your car's extended warranty. Why are you running? It's a great deal. Oh, well, they can run there. They're healthy. How are we looking, ladies? I must smell or something. It's you. It's not me. It has to be you. Pretty sure everyone else is fencing today. Glad it's not me. Next paddock. Ooh, found the hole. That's what she said. Papa, right, come on. Jeez, who put this away? <laughs> Just taking a quick detour. I'm gonna go feed the lambs up the lane. It looks like we've got a bit of a detour first. When the side quest has a side quest. Alright, off we go. I forgot my automatic because I might have put the AB on switch to automatic. What happens? <laughs> oh, this is a rough game, really. Hold that. Thanks. Much better. Someone's nicked me not. I did grab blades out of the car because I thought I needed to change it. So I guess we're just using the blades. Typo's enjoying a sit in the sun. I'd like to bring a third one up, but I don't like its survival chances. Considering last week's incident we'll bring one and we'll say a prayer for the burrito gods it's just casually pine trees growing in amongst these bales we've done it we're here i'm just feeding this out to the lambs we've got these barley bales from i think they're three years old now they're still all in pretty good condition so i'm thinking you don't know unless you try i just thought i'd have a look and what sort of condition they're in before I feed them out. It looks like it's oats. I was under the impression it's barley. Because there's barley here. There's oats here. Oh, I wonder if this is a weedy paddock. A weed paddock and that's why we cut it. Looks like they kind of like it. They're having a bit of a munch. It's a good sign. Hang on, let me just prepare my blade. Where's the string? Bale's out. And apparently they are too. They've left the paddock. There we go. Half are going up there. Half are going down here. Side boat, you're going for a run off. Yes, bring them back. Thanks. Why did you leave? I don't understand why you left. Yes, go back in your paddock. They do this every fucking time. God. Good job. Done well. These ladies seem to be more pregnant than the others. However, still no lambs. More sheep. Also close to lambing these ones. Still no lambs. I'm just checking the sheep behind them. We have put minerals in here to, um, you know, see if, you know, that helps them at all. We've got this one here. This is what it is. They haven't touched it very much. That's a sign that they're content and they don't need extra nutrients, which is a bit of any good. Checking the merinos. 
Yep, they've still got no brain cells. Go through to the next paddock. This next paddock also has the minerals. This is actually the paddock that gets Valera staggers. So we've put the minerals in there to see if that reduces the risk. Is one. Oh, there's the second one there. Have they touched it? It does not look like it. It's a good sign. Dad and Jackson have just finished the fence. So I'm bringing up the prime lime lambs to be taking the, go take the rams out. Half of them have already let themselves into this paddock. They're meant to be behind those trees. These are the other ones here. Those four aren't rams, they can stay. Uh... Yeah, these are all used. I'm not bringing these. Typo, get in the car. Oh, well, lucky I checked. That saved me a job. Typo, you're being sacrificed. Oh, yay, I'm a sacrifice. Go down the cliff. I think she's going. Oh, there she is. On the ladies, and they're going to go around the dam. They're going to be fucking pissed, aren't they? Back the way you came, thanks. Good. Good girl. Now we just need to find the rams. I wasn't going to, but I'm going to run them through the race. I'm not going to be able to handle these rams. They're too big. I missed at least one ram. And there's a couple of fat lambs that are in here that aren't meant to be. So they've been pulled out as well. I'll put these into there. Then we're going to have to pull some others out. Well, that works too. <laughs> okay, mate. Thanks for that. You made my life very easy. Come on. Pew, pew, pew. Pew, 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 pew. There we go. You're going straight. No, don't come this way. There we go. All right, need to make sure all of their ear tags are on the left side. Right side, they are fat lambs. Does any of you have bull sex? So we're missing a ram. We'll go find dad. Typo! Come on! Typo! She's fine, don't worry. No cuts or anything. I think she just underestimated how much of a jump she'd need. <laughs> Only thing bruised is her ego. <laughs> this fence is now being ripped out as well. Yeah, so they're putting in the fence there now. We're back at the scene of the crime. Typo, come on. All right, go. <whistles> Send these away. Doing really well, slug. Thank you. Good girl, that was very good. That was very good. <laughs> can they comprehend to go around the gate? They can. Excellent. Update. I ran my hands and stuff over her. It doesn't seem to be any hot spots or anything, so I think she's okay. Probably just bruised. We're on the way up back. Let me guess. My prediction. There's going to be no lambs. These ewes here. Oh, we stole. These ewes here look pretty good. Um, look close to lambing. So I'm thinking my chances of a lamb might be more than I expected. Still don't think there's going to be any. But instead of 100% no, it's going to be a 95%. More almost, but not quite. Oh! <gasps> There's a lamb, there's a lamb, someone has lambs. Excellent. Fresh too, she hasn't got the afterbirth out yet. Aren't you good mum? The lamb's pretty fresh, she's still looking, licking it. That you over there might have soft feet and sore feet and that's why she's not with the others. Or she might be having a lamb. Could you imagine if we got, oh, could you imagine if we got two today? Is it a lamb or are you sore? No. Oh, oh my god, it's baby. Oh, she's fresh too. Right, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. It's two this afternoon. Holy shit. The best.
baby has just stood up. Soon. We got two more paddocks with potential babies. Excuse me, ladies, do you have any babies? Not looking too promising from a distance. Just uh, another one, just a fucking another one. That is number four. We're done. We've been around all the sheep. I don't know what I'm doing now, probably fencing. Just in time to put the wire on. What you do is you put it through and then you go, do one underneath, one over, and then just twist it on. I've gone soft, I got the twitching thing. It helps it get a real nice tight wrap compared to you know, tight is better. Ev's just walked out the final line for the top bit, this one here. He's just tying that on now and then that just needs to be tied up on this end. The fencing on the property, what needed to be replaced, is done. There's plenty more to do, so stay tuned. Good morning. Today we're leaving the farm. 